Hello friends, this is Arun and welcome in my channel of Forex Creation. Today I will teach you uh, a 3D text effect and I have already made a tutorial on that um, but in this case I will use this background, grunge background uh, to get uh, some extra stuff to it. So see this is my original image um, and I uh, now after that uh, Firstly, I have this uh, background, simple background. Now, I will add a text to it 3D. Then I will put further effect to this. So, let's see how to get this type of work in Photoshop CC. So, I am in the Photoshop CC and I have downloaded a, a grunge wallpaper and you can download it from uh, Google and there are so many wallpapers. So, Firstly, make a new copy for uh, uh, grunge wallpaper and add text to this. I will put text here so that I want this text. Make it uh, center and uh, fill it with color. Uh, click on here, uh, press character. Now choose the color and I want this uh, yellow tone and I want dark. Mm, something like this okay that's nice mm, okay now I will delete this now right click on here and go to new 3d activation from selected layer now click on here uh, it's really heavy command so it is taking time so again go to layers then uh, right click on this background now click on uh, sorry right click on there and uh, click on postcard it is very simple now again come to layers now merge all these layers uh, I will select both layers by pressing control click now control E to merge these two layers now again go to 3d now go to 3d ocean now click on render now it will take time because it is really a heavy command so now after rendering this i have got this effect now right click on here then uh, click on rasterize 3d now click on here uh, i will go to levels i want more light so because i will adjust the sliders that's nice mm, now I will make a copy for this layer so that uh, I can get more shadows reduce its opacity even I will make a mask click on here and click on mask and uh, choose this radial tool gradient tool uh, I want linear gradient so press shift and press top to bottom okay see now again go to this layer additional layer now click on gradient uh, I want bottom to top mm. reduce its opacity I will make a new layer again and fill it with black now go to filter render cloud soft light
this is before and this is after now I will make new layer again mm. now choose brush tool choose black control set hardness 0 opacity around 23 here control Z now merge all these layers uh, I think I should hide this layer now merge all these layers now go to filter then render then we have this lighting effects click on there now adjust the light I want sport light now I will adjust the angle now play with all settings so that uh, to get the perfect effect perfect lighting and a very natural lighting on that so it, f it should feel that it is very natural light now you can play with color I want uh, this uh, yellow shade this is white and this is yellow shade now click on ok mm. I will try this point this is point light this is infinity this is again sport light oh. now click on ok uh, I got the light effect properly so this is before and uh, this is after I reduce its opacity about uh, 77 this is before this is after if you want to play more and uh, you can 
do one thing more and go to color balance adjustment layer then you can change the color at any at any time so again go to this layer go to levels I want some foggy effect so I will adjust output values so see the effect and it's really a nice effect having very soft look on that and having very soft light on this logo so I hope you have got the idea and you can merge all ideas like I have at a background of grunge instead of uh, putting a plain background to this logo and uh, you can subscribe my channel and you can send me mail you can send me message if you want any help Thank you friends, keep watching on this creation.